when we got off to a great start, um, I suppose we were lucky enough to get a few wins early on in the league. That set set the tempo for us. Um, we we had it wrapped up with with two wins, two games to go. Our first target for the year was to win, was to get promoted out of the league. Um, second target, I suppose, we haven't got a win under under John Evans in Championship. Um, so all we're looking at now, at the minute, at the minute is, is Leitrim in the hide. Um, so it's just it's all about Leitrim at the minute. Our squad stands in in good position at the moment. Uh, injuries front isn't too bad in comparison to other years gone by. Thankfully, uh, listen, we've got obviously when the draw was made against Roscommon. It was always going to be a game the boys couldn't wait for, you know, going over to the Hyde, having a good maybe 12, 13,000 people there. It's a massive game it's for fans especially, you know, there's always great rivalry between both counties. But listen, the boys are confident going into it. I suppose the fact that we bet for Scotland earlier on the year will give us that little bit extra more confidence in our, in our own belief, you know, and they're obviously going to be tough getting promoted out of Division 3 and with the 21s getting to an Iron final. But yeah, as he says, listen, it's going to be an interesting battle, but it's one that we're really looking forward to. It's great to have you at home and to have our supporters there. So we'd be expecting a fairly big crowd out. Um, to get us kicking off in the championship. Well, one thing you're going to get 100% commitment. Listen, the boys have put in a serious amount of effort this year. Sean has come in, he's cleaned the slate, you know, and a lot of new boys on board again. Um, Hyde Park, obviously, listen, on a, on a championship day, it's not going to be an easy place to be, but we've hopefully tightened up the fence last year. We're conceding a lot of goals. We've kind of tried to rectify that. It's, it's stuff of dreams. It's what you dream of when you're a young lad of, of, of winning Connor titles. It'd be a massive, a massive honour. Words couldn't describe what it would mean for our boys, as we were mentioning there in the meeting, 20 years since it happened. But to be fair, I'll be honest with you, we haven't even thought about it. We can't, let's be honest, get ourselves carried away with that. We're in the tough side of the draw. Even if we overcome our scum, and you're, you're looking at Mayo again, you know. So, as I says, a good championship year, I'd be honest with you, for us, would be firstly just to get over, if we could get over our scum, it'd be, it'd be a successful year in itself.